Now, who here has heard of the term Web 3? The first era of the web was about websites. It was called the read web. You go to the website and you access information. The web was a platform for the presentation of information. Then about 15 years ago, the web evolved and it became a read-write web where you could not only access information, you could do things. You could contribute to a social media discussion. You could add your own information onto Facebook or you could add an entry into Wikipedia. A read-write web is very different. Blockchain represents Web 3. The Web 3 is about assets and value. It means that when you create some value or you do something on the web, you get to own it. Today, if you go onto Facebook and create some value, Mark Zuckerberg owns it, not you. With Web3, that's turned on its head. This is taking us into a new kind of digital age, which I believe will bring about very profound changes to all of our institutions. The Industrial Age, was an age of hierarchies where someone at the top had knowledge or power and they created things and sold it down in the hierarchy. So we created newspapers and we pushed them out. We create products and we sell them. We create television shows and we broadcast them, right? We have governments, we elect our government leaders, and then for four years, they broadcast to us. We're not really engaged. We're inert as citizens, not active. We receive government, 